what is going on people welcome back to another video on aj forward in today's video guys we do have an update on p network also known as pnt which has pumped up nearly 30 percent in the last 24 hours and is currently trading at just over 22 cents so we're going to be looking at where is this crypto heading to next is it going to keep pumping or is it going to crash back down in value looking at its prediction over the next couple of hours days weeks months and also going into 2025 sorry not 2025 2024 what can we expect from p network what is the highest it can hit next year so on and so on and also covering both buyers and sellers point of view is now the right time to buy it is it too late or if you're on a profit is it time to sell it and take out your profits before it drops back down in value or should you hold on to it before it pumps up even higher but before i get into all of that stuff guys if you're new to the channel and haven't subscribed yet make sure to go down and smash that subscribe button as well as like the video as i am trying to hit a hundred thousand subscribers by the end of the year and if you guys can help me hit that target i will be doing a cryptocurrency giveaway which you guys can join by simply subscribing to the channel and for a bonus entry follow me on instagram link to that will be in the description box down below so we are currently looking at the candlestick pattern chart with the Fibonacci scale which I'm going to be using later on in the video to do some technical analysis but for now I'm just going to hide this and I'm going to bring up the usual MACD indicator to do some price prediction as I'm pretty sure that's what most of you guys are here for. So we are looking at the daily chart and at the top here we've got the purple line running across the chart which is the SMA indicator giving us the average value of P network which is here in purple at 16 cents however it is actually trading at a much higher value here in red at nearly 23 cents meaning it's performing quite well and much better than expected so let's zoom in into the 30 minute chart for the short term traders and then i'll move on to the hourly daily and weekly chart for the long term investors like myself but before i do that guys just a little disclaimer as usual this is no financial advice i'm not a financial advisor anything i say is from my own prediction and my take on this crypto and any gains or losses you guys make i will not be responsible for so zooming into the 30 minute chart guys we can see here that the blue and the orange are looking quite steep heading towards the bullish direction looking again whenever a MACD indicator looks this steep that means it's not realistic so the exact same applies here the only reason why it's looking so steep is because of the major increase that's taken place over the last couple of hours the graph thinks it's going to carry on this way it's going to keep pumping and so on however that is not the case i'm expecting it to take a little bit of a step back over the next 12 to 14 hours so in the early hours of tomorrow to tomorrow midday i'm expecting p network to be trading around the 21 to 22 cents target again it's not a major drop but it's a little bit of a step back compared to where it's trading at the moment but that does not mean that it's not going to pump any further of course it will it's likely to pump up to around 23 24 cents over the next couple of hours before it slowly starts to drop back down in value in the early hours of tomorrow down to about 21 cents moving on to the hourly chart next couple of days again guys the blue and the orange now are still looking very steep heading towards the bullish direction meaning it is not realistic however over the next seven to eight days so towards the end of this week early next week i am expecting p network to be trading at a slightly higher value than where it is at the moment potentially around 23 to 24 cents is where i'm expecting it to be trading at towards the end of this week and early next week as well however in between that time so over the next couple of days it's likely to drop back down in value below 20 cents potentially trading around 18 to 19 cents by mid this week to over the next couple of days guys before it slowly starts to gain value towards the end of this week and early next week as well heading to around 24 to 25 cents in target is where i'm expecting this crypto to be trading at towards the next week or so moving on to the daily chart next couple of weeks what can we see here the blue line is still clearly looking quite steep heading towards the bullish direction however the orange line is looking much more realistic it is just about slanting towards the positive direction meaning an overall minimal gain in value is what is expected from p network over the next six to eight weeks guys so late december early january 2023 sorry 2024 i am expecting p network to be trading just over 30 cents again so to some of you guys it may be a major increase to some of you guys it may not however that is a reasonable increase in value over the next two months especially the way p network has been performing as you guys can see pumps drops pumps drops pumps drops so yeah 
is a repeated cycle but overall yes it has been moving towards a positive direction over the last two months guys as you guys can see even though it's been volatile it has been moving upwards so i'm expecting it to be quite volatile as well over the next six to eight weeks but i'm expecting it to move towards a positive direction hitting just around 30 cents in target as i am also expecting the whole crypto market to be bullish as well including bitcoin i'm expecting it to hit over forty two thousand dollars by early next year so let's get rid of the macd indicator and bring on the fibonacci scale as guys can see we are still trading in the red zone however we are not too far off from hitting the resistance target here which is 48 cents which i'm expecting p network to be hitting that in q2 of 2024 so in the next six to eight months we should be able to hit the resistance start not six to eight months sorry four to six months we should be able to hit the resistance target here and potentially even head into the green zone in the second half of next year hitting over 50 cents in target guys but again it depends on how the crypto market performs with any major pumps or bull runs and crashes and so on these things will have a major impact not just on the value of p network but the whole crypto market in general but if i'm able to predict such thing i will let you guys know as soon as possible on my instagram page and on my youtube channel as well so make sure you guys stay subscribed and turn on the bell notifications to get notified every time i upload so let's go into the coin market cap website here we can see the trading volume has gone up over 760 percent in the last 24 hours making it 19 million dollars in trading which is again a huge huge increase in trading we are seeing way more people looking at the crypto buying it and selling it as well from both point of view as it is one of the top gainers according to binance or even the top gainer meaning yes guys it is getting a lot of attention right now so yeah this is my take and my prediction on the scriptos. For those of you guys asking, would I buy the crypto right now or would I sell it? I would definitely not buy it because it is overvalued and I'm not expect I wouldn't expect it to give me enough ROI that you know if I invest it right now and I'm into crypto for the long term so I would probably wait for it to crash down if I really wanted to invest into it. My maximum buying price for this crypto would be anywhere below 10 cents. I would consider buying it. Anything above that, I wouldn't even think about investing into the crypto. And for the seller's point of view, would I sell it right now? Yes, I would, but not all of it. And if I had $1,000, I would probably sell about $400 worth. So about 40% of my investment in P Network I would sell. And the remaining 60%, I would hold on to it going into 2024. Meaning I've taken out some profit and I'm still holding P Network, which works both ways for me. But yeah, comment down below what are you guys doing? Are you guys buying it? Are you guys selling it? Or are you going to be holding it? Comment down below as I'm very intrigued to see how many of you guys are bullish and how many of you guys are bearish on this crypto. And also let me know your prediction on this crypto what is the highest figure you guys are expecting this crypto to hit in 2024 comment down below guys and on that note i'm going to end the video here guys i just want to say a massive thank you to every single one of you who have been subscribing liking commenting and just supporting the channel in any way or form and especially all the subscribers out there thank you guys so much as it helps me out a lot and means a lot to me as i am trying to hit 100k by the end of the year and at the end of the day guys it's free to subscribe so why don't you go down and smash that subscribe button and like the video and I catch all of you guys in my next crypto update which should hopefully be later on today or tomorrow. Until then, take care and peace.